Recently, I've had a lot of trouble with my desktop PC on Windows. When I try to put it to sleep using the start menu, the monitor turns off, but the fans stay on. Turns out, the thing isn't sleeping at all. Moving the mouse or hitting the keyboard turns the monitor right back to the lock screen. This has been really frustrating, because not only does my PC make noise, but it also uses a lot of energy when it's on. I could shut down, but that's a huge nuisance that I can't deal with on a daily basis. This sleeping problem almost drove me away from using my PC, at least with Windows. But then, I found the culprit. Today, I want to share that with you and hopefully help you fix your problems too. The problem in question is hybrid sleep. Hybrid sleep is basically a combination of sleeping and hibernating a computer, introduced with Windows Vista. Usually, sleep turns everything off but gives enough power to the memory to keep its contents. This way, you can wake your computer and have all your work available. If the computer loses power though, you can lose your work. Hibernating on the other hand writes the contents of the memory to the disk so the computer can be completely turned off. Even if you lose power, you can still restore your work. Hybrid sleep on Windows combines the two by first writing your memory to your disk and then sleeping. But why is this only on desktops? Hybrid sleep is often used on desktops because they're more vulnerable to power loss. Pull the plug and everything's gone. On the other hand, laptops can use the last of their battery power to emergency hibernate. And they often don't use hybrid sleep anyway, because it takes longer for the computer to hybrid sleep than it does to normally sleep. And unfortunately, Windows can be pretty buggy, so sometimes your computer can fail to go to sleep when it tries to hybrid sleep. So to fix your computer not sleeping, you want to turn off hybrid sleep. The process is the same on Windows 10 and Windows 11, and for that matter, Vista 7 and 8 too. The specific menu you want to get to is Control Panel, and then Hardware and Sound, and then under Power Options, Edit Power Plan, and in that menu, change Advanced Power Settings. But it's much easier to just search for Edit Power Plan in the Start menu. Just in case you can't, I'm leaving the path to that Control Panel menu in the description. After you enter the Advanced Settings menu, double-click Sleep, and double-click Allow Hybrid Sleep. Then, turn the setting off if it's on. If you couldn't find hybrid sleep under the menu, chances are your computer doesn't support it. One way to check is to enter this command in the command prompt. I'll also paste it in the video description. This command should show you if hybrid sleep is supported by your computer. And that's it! Hopefully that fixed your computer. You can try putting it to sleep to see if it worked. And if it didn't, a few other tricks to try are reinstalling your drivers, especially your graphics and network drivers, and disabling hibernation. Before you go, I will say that hybrid sleep can keep you from losing your work during a power loss. If your power is unreliable, hybrid sleep might be a necessity. Then again, if you're there, you should be using a UPS. That's going to be it for this video. I hope this helped, and I'll see you in the next episode of Tiger Steve Tech.